my name's Chris, Chris Fallone. I'm the vicar here at uh, the Church of the Saviour in uh, Collyhurst. Um, I've been here two years. Um, it's um, quite a challenging place to live, but it's fun and it's exciting and keeps me very busy. I've um, completed a community reporters course with uh, People's Voice Media which was great. I think there was about half a dozen of us or something like that on the course. But well, that led uh, our, me to um, acquire the skills and resources to be able to produce um, a small DVD, only about 10 minutes, something like that, which um, attempted to celebrate the life of this community um, during a bishop's visit uh, to see me in my new parish. Well, I try and do that in different ways, really. We've, we've, we've got a really good piece of church plant in terms of the building. So I try and make some of that available to people like People's Voice Media, Manchester Advocation Service. And from time to time, they try uh, running a whole variety of different things designed to um, increase people's skills in things like photography or computing. Uh, sometimes it's about confidence skills to help them in the employment process. So we try and do that as, as much as we can. And, and of course, within my life as a, as a church minister too, we're, we're quite a high-tech church, so we have audio-visual equipment and we use computing and mixing desks and all that requires uh, me to help people learn those skills and learn them myself a lot of the time. So yeah, so it's an ongoing process really, just my fascination with technology, I guess. I, I like to consider myself a lifelong learner. Um, I left school as soon as I could, um, but that didn't stop me learning. I eventually did graduate but as, as an adult student. And, and, I, I, and I think there are two important things, really. I think learning has to be fun. It's got to be something you can easily engage with and enjoy, that kind of thing. And, and I guess, too, it's really important that what you engage with is relevant. You know, So if what you do is like to go on holiday to Spain, then learn Spanish because it's relevant and it, and it helps your holiday. If, like me, you're a bit of a techno freak, then you know, learn uh, PC skills or, or, or related um, technologies. So I think uh, fun, I think relevant, and, and truthfully, I think it should be lifelong. You know, um, I think it keeps you young, I think it keeps your mind active, and, and there's no excuse not to do it, really. Well, that's a really interesting question, and it could be a long answer, a short answer. Um, but when I offered myself for, for ministry in the church, um, you have to go through a selection process and that selection process decided I needed a pre-college course uh, because but basically thought I was thick because I didn't have all the relevant qualifications well I I really enjoyed that course I engaged with it completely and aced the course um, on the back of that I then went to the, said to the church and suggested they'd awakened my desire for learning so they owed me uh, the chance to take that as far as I could so they agreed to finance me uh, through to graduation, but they wouldn't allow me to go further than that on their on their ticket. But yes, yeah, so I graduated uh, at uh, BA level, and and the rest is history, I guess.